Okay, so Alice is just going to take us through a few stretches before we start. All right, guys, good morning. Welcome to Fit Around My Baby and Toddler. Right, we're just going to do a quick warm up um, and do some stretches. So, can you just take your right ear to your right shoulder? Just one way and then the left to the left. Just a couple of times to ease your neck up. Out. Okay, shoulders back. We're just going to circle our arms a couple of times and we'll just work our way down our body. And forwards. Come into our waist. Take your arms up like this and twist your waist and your hips round. And look behind you with your eyes. So take your head and your neck with you. Okay, down to our hips. We'll just open them up. So take your right leg up and out. And the same on the left. Feels weird doing this here. I know it does. <laughs> it does feel weird. Okay, what we're going to do is just going to do a few gentle squats. Sit down into your heels and up again. Get all the creaks out of your knees. And down to our ankles. So a big stretch up. And let's touch our toes. And we'll do that twice. Okay, there are four sections to today's workout. Legs, bum, back and shoulders, ending on abs, okay? So Lucy, do you want to start? Yes, let's get ready to go. Okay, we've got four um, exercises in the first bit. One is a split squat, that's one on one leg. Second exercise is change leg. Then we've got our skaters, yeah. You can step those out if you've got funny joints or any issues at the minute. And then we've got jump squats, like this. And we're going to use our clock today. We're going old school to time it. So I'll tell you all when to start and stop. You won't hear a beep, okay? We're going in five seconds. Left leg forward. We're just going to come in a lunge. Off we go. Sit in that lunge and pulse. If you've got your baby, this is perfect to hold them at the centre of your body. Or some weights. If you've got two dumbbells, I'd suggest holding them either side or a kettlebell, holding up to your chest. We're halfway there, we're gonna go straight into the other leg. At the, not the beat when I tell you. We're doing 40 seconds on and 20 off. Oh, wow. <coughs> oh, is that what we normally do? Oh. Yeah, we do, but it's real different. Right, carry oh, on, right. guys. No, never mind, don't worry. I'll explain what we're talking about now. Okay, and rest. So actually we'll rest that leg for 20 seconds and then we'll do right leg forward for 40 seconds. So on the thing that we decided to do, it was a two minute work, one minute rest. I thought we were doing that. Ah, right. But we'll do it like this because we know this works for our timing. Oh yeah, cool. All right, right leg forward, down we go. Try and keep your chest nice and upright. You can see a slight, you can bring your chest over a little bit but what I mean when I say upright is keeping your chest flat. Don't let your shoulders drop. Plumbing issues here, I don't know if you can hear that. <laughs> the men next door with the crane. Okay, go, we've got 15 seconds left on this leg. Should be really feeling, I did a bit of leg yesterday, so I'm aching. Yeah. This is hard for me today. Five seconds, then we've got our 20 reps. Before we go into rest, everybody. Before we go into the skaters, I've got the back head on. Yeah, fifteen yeah. seconds. If you need a drink or anything, guys, grab whatever you need at this point. Ten seconds left, and five. Get ready for the skaters. Off we go. So if you have got your baby, just do the curtsy step behind. So you're taking the jump out, and you can still hold the little one. Keep going everyone, I'm just going to come and have a see how you're all doing. Looking good. Great guys, keep going. We've got 10 seconds left. Try and keep your chest upright, it helps if you look forward with this. Helps your posture. Okay, and rest again. 20 seconds rest. In for our last one, which is the squat jump from the side. Nice and explosive jump. And again, if you've got your baby around your feet, 
just squat. You can even squat holding your baby if you want. Off we go. Jump squats, 40 seconds worth. not wanting to do too much jumping, just squat. Really push yourself. Ten seconds, let's get to the end. So, while well, you've got the most energy, I think. Yeah. Utilize that. Every day is a leg day. It <laughs> actually is. Try and tilt your hips forward to start yourself moving over and target the correct muscle if you sit in the right position. Five seconds left. Good. And rest. 20 seconds. I'm going to go again on the right leg, shake your legs out, big deep breaths in between, five seconds till we go, right leg forward, off we go, just think on the way through how can you improve your posture, get the most out of the exercise by doing it accurately. Halfway there. Fifteen seconds to go now. I think I might do the uh, baby adaption version. Yeah. The skaters and the jumps. <laughs> I don't blame you. At least my invisible baby here. Should have brought Arthur. Five seconds left. Well done and rest. Okay, so it's our skaters looking upright, jumps if you can, steps if you need to. 10 seconds. I think we might have a doll in our baby area upstairs. <laughs> Probably do. <laughs> Off we go. I'm going to jump. I'm going to hold that baby. Hal's going to do it. Sure <laughs> it's a cop out. Don't judge me guys. It's been a long weekend. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Okay, halfway. You've got ten seconds left. last of our legs so that's good to know for now <laughs> I can now. see what's coming next we're moving on to glutes but that will also get your legs as well so but these I really have your legs these ones okay off we go jumps or oh, just a normal squat I'm gonna go up onto my toes turn the blood my baby get all down my calf muscles as well 
So I'm using every muscle in my leg. It's pretty warm in this gym. Oh, it really is, is eh? That makes a change though, because normally we're blasting and heating out because it's so yeah. cold. And, uh, we've not experienced summer in here, have we? Keep with it, we've got 10 seconds. Although I've just been into the toilet and there's a massive gym plant growing <laughs> through the wall. Wow, well, we've not been here. Nature's gone wild. Rest, okay. Giving you a full minute now to rest. Before round two, performed by Alice. How do you get a drink? <sighs> Let's see how everybody's doing. Give us a thumbs up, Tom. Oh, I see a little Evie there. Hello, gorgeous. Did I say your name? You've been a good girl. Yeah, do some colouring. Yeah. What's your drawing? Do you have a scribble? Oh, I like your teepee, Evie, in the background. Oh, that is a good idea, yeah, definitely. Kate, how's this? She's on the sofa. She's still doing her reading eggs, Kate. Yeah, <laughs> whizzing through it. So we're writing our own novel next. How old's Kate's child? <laughs> oh, right, doing it again. Good sneaky work there. And it's a, she must be three. Okay. Right, we are going on to squat tap. So. Hip, feet hip width apart. You're just going to squat yourself down and as you stand up, take your right leg out to tap on your toes. Then squat to the left, just transferring your weight. Again, 40 on, 20 off. I'm just going to wait till my timer gets to o'clock and then I can count 40 better in my head. Gives you an extra 10 seconds. It does. To rest. Oh gosh, we can like that. Move my back a bit so we're definitely social distancing. Okay, and off we go. Squat yourselves down. When you're squatting, make sure you're squatting back into your heels. Again, chest is up. So if you've got your baby, put them central around your waist. And you're just trying to keep really squatted down and avoid straightening your legs and standing up. Okay, we're halfway there. So really good up your glutes. Hold down your thighs. Which, like Lucy said before, you've been burning calories all day if you work your legs. Five seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, rest of 20. We're going to go into a squat pulse, which is a wide leg, deep squat, knees are face, go in the same direction as your toes, and you're just going to sit back onto your heels, let your bum take the weight, and pull yourself up and down. Babies, round your waist. Okay, three. Two, one, down we go, big wide leg squat. Same babies around your waist, but one's colouring, one's doing reading eggs, and one's not there. Far easier. Teddy and Arthur are very tired today. There's tantrums from the second they woke up because they've just been playing out in the sun, it just takes them out of yeah, them. Out of them. And we've seen more people social distance in the park and stuff than we normally would. Yeah. So I think it's been a bit of a sensory excitement overload. Yeah, definitely. Five seconds. Keep going, guys. Go through the burn. Three, two, one. Okay. Good work. Okay, next exercise we're going to do star jumps. So if you're not holding your baby, just an old star jump. If you are, just take one leg out at a time. Okay, you've got ten seconds. Five seconds, three, two, one, let's go. Go as fast or as slow as you like. Let's just burn up some calories, get our heart rates going, keeping yourself fit. It's also quite a good pelvic floor exercise, this is Nick. It is. Got to in. Got to. Turn and do that all day. All day. That's basically what I'm doing when I'm doing this. Yeah. <laughs> Probably subconsciously because we have to do once we've had a child. Three, two, one. Okay. Last thing we're going to do is a 90 degree squat jump. So if you've got your baby, you're just going to squat it out. Just quick squats. If not, we're just going to turn 90 degrees, 
squat jump, round. That's the middle, left, that's the middle, right. Okay, three, two, one, let's go. Gonna show you the holding the baby one again. Squats. <laughs> just the squats, just so we all know what we're doing. Okay, you've got 15 seconds. Well done, Lucy. Come on. I can do it. You can do it. Happy to you. I need somebody to do me. I'm getting lazy. Five seconds. Keep it up. And rest. Well done. Okay, you've got the round rest for a minute. Get a drink. We're going to go from the top. Legs on fire, guys. My word. So what are your kids doing today? Um, they're with Jamie at the minute. When I said I was leaving the house this morning to come and do a bit of work, he wasn't impressed. Jamie? Yeah, he's like, what? I've <laughs> not told him. I, I have not told Chris. I was like, okay, good night. Yeah. We planned for a week to come and do it together. He does it three days a week to go and get to his offices to do some work. But the minute I say I need to. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> so um, he's looking after them for now. And then. We should have told them to meet at the park or something. Yeah, Chris and Jamie, we should. Right, we have got about 15 seconds. I'm going to go. That's the top of that round, which was the squat taps. Okay, nice, low. I guess more garden time, because the weather is still I know. divine. I think Wednesday's gonna rain and it's gonna cool down by the end of the week. Yeah, okay. okay. Let's go, squat taps. Just tap them with your toes, slow or as fast as you like. Keep your core tight, shoulders back. Then try and keep it low if you can, not coming up. Sit in that squat, just sliding those legs out to the side. Big deep breaths because we know what's coming at the end. It's the more cardio round. So we've been writing these workouts, lots of toning to begin with, and then a cardio blast to finish, just to get the blood pumping around your muscles to really benefit you. And we're also you're working to the climax, aren't you? A hard bit, okay? And rest. Do you feel like nothing once you've done those squat jumps? I know. Everything else seems to. Oh, right, we're going into the squat pulse. Why did I not put my hair up? <sighs> Five mm. seconds. Alright, well, legs nice and wide. Three, two, one, down you go. Don't bend your knees over your toes, sit yourself back. You should be squeezing your bum. That's what's doing the pulse motion. We're halfway. Twenty-five seconds. We're halfway through the round, and then we're going to move on. Some shoulders back, leaving the legs out for a bit. Three, two, one. Oh, you come. Well done. Next exercise, star jumps. If you've got your babies, just take one leg out. Not so much the squat, just leg out. So it's not the squat tap from the beginning, it's half a star jump. Okay, five seconds. Three, two, one. Let's go. jumps. Okay, if you've got your babies, just do me an old squat. 
If you've got your resistance bands, you want to put them on if you're holding your baby to help with your squat. Now's the time. Okay. In three, two, one. Let's go. from your knees to your thighs, not just dipping your head. That is a tough one. We've got 10 seconds left. Get in as many as you can. Really, really good. Arms and your chest. Three, two, one. Well done. 20 second rest. Before we go into a mountain climb, we're all gonna be sick of this position. So up like this. Bringing our knees in, and if you've got a baby in front of you, just gently step your knees in, so as not to cause them any harm. Off we go. So fast knees or slow knees. Keep, again, flatter back as you can. Nice, straight, strong arms, and nice, tight core. You're halfway. Keep going. That's why it is hard on the legs, these mountain climbers, but it's just as tough on your arms. Holding your body up. You've got five seconds. Okay, rest. Well done. Oh, it says we're running out of time. I'm really sweating, so. 
five minutes off today. It is tough, so the heat as well. It is the heat as well. Five seconds. We're gonna do walk down. Sorry, so one of these on your hand and up. Let's go. Forty seconds. Walk down and walk back up. If you're feeling really hardcore, you can add a press at the bottom. But because we've already done some press ups, I will pass. Oh, I'm not feeling that hardcore for Monday. Maybe on a Friday. Okay, last one. Run a little bit longer. One more here, one more. And yes, good. We will have a full minute. We'll do that round one more time and then I think we'll have time for one or two core. Yeah, so we'll start a slightly late and we're waiting for people to come. Yes. Just get the hair off my shoulders. Okay, so keep going. I think I've got a bobble. Oh, I've got me so another bad yeah. Alice is just gonna have to get her hair tied back. Mine's a bit short. Oh, good work guys. Ooh, so it's our plank with our shoulder tap first. If everyone's ready, let's get on our mats. Going in five. Up we come and tap. So remember, I always have to remind myself, try not to sway my body too much. Let the work come through my arms and holding my core tight. I always play directly with your shoulders. I always tend to put them in front of me. Yeah. And uh, Alice is just saying try and get your hands under your shoulders rather than out to the front, which I also do. Your body looks for cheats naturally. In three, two, one, rest. 20 seconds rest. We're going to that narrow press up, wide press up. Probably the toughest one. I'm going to give it a go on my feet this time. It's the narrow that it's we're the narrow hard, hard, isn't it? It's Off we go, get ready. Yes, chest. It's, uh, it is hard for some reason. Down to the side. And if you are on your knees, bring your whole thigh forward with you, don't leave your bum in the air when you press. We're halfway. Ten seconds left. My form is dropping, so I do the last bit on my knees. And done. Good. We've got our mountain climbers after our mini break. And then our walk rounds. And that is another complete round. Going in five seconds. Practice on your wrist this as well. So if your wrists are aching, you can do the mountain climbers on your forearms and just slowly bring your knees in. Yeah. Down considerably now. <laughs> we really have. We're both feeling the same today, obviously. But we're here, we're doing it. Come on. 
I know, and it's just 30 minutes and you're done for the whole day. And it's definitely a good workout because I'm knackered. It's all over the body as well. Okay, I'm going to move on to some core exercise after this. How much longer have we got, Lucy? We are done. Oh, well done. yes, okay, round break. About a minute, get a drink, and I'm going to do some core, okay? And then it's over. Yes, for another day. During the round rest, I'll just show you what we're going to do. We're going to go on so, the other side. Yeah. I'm going to do side plank. I'm going to do high side plank. So you're going to come up, hand, fingers pointing away on your shoulder. Right foot on top of left foot. This arm up. You're just going to hold it, okay? You want a nice diagonal line. If your wrist is sore, come down. Onto your forearm, forearm facing away from you. Okay, so we're going to do 40 seconds. Everybody get ready down the mat. In three, two, one. I'm actually going to do a low plank just because my wrists are feeling it today. And 40 seconds is quite a long time for this. So I don't want the pressure on my wrist. If you find it difficult, you can put this arm down to support you. Just keep this diagonal. Okay. We've got about 10 seconds, guys. Hold it, hold it. Nice and tight. Three, two, one. Rest. Good. So we're going to do exactly the same the other way. So just get your rest in. I'm looking forward to the stretching today, Lucy. Oh, yeah, that's some good moves for us. Okay, 10 seconds. Get yourself ready in your position. We're ready to bring yourself up. Again, if it's too hard, put one leg in front of the other, okay? Otherwise, try and stack it feet on feet. Three, two, one, up oh, we go. Let's just think about something else. Take our mind off what we're doing. Think about what we're going to do today, what we're going to make for our lunch. Mm, yes. We're super healthy today. I say this every Monday. Oh, come <laughs> on, this is the week. Coming up to 30 seconds. It's the 1st of June, isn't it? So oh, yeah. If you can't be good today, yeah. your whole June is doomed. So everyone who's made it today, go you. Yes. You've got okay. a positive month. And rest. I sound like Jamie there. June is doomed. <laughs> Not everyone well else today. Well, well, it's doomed June. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do plank. Can we do high plank if you like, or low plank. High plank is easier. So let's come down to our forearms. In three, two, one. Let's go. Nice low bum. Core tight. Elbows directly on your shoulders, and just hold it. Listen to us twitter on. Nice deep breaths. Planking is supposed to be very good to relieve a bad headache if you've got one. For some reason, I think it's the concentration. Um, but yeah, I know this lady and she does it when she's getting migraines. So three, three go. two, one. Okay. Yeah, and obviously we've all had babies. Cause weaker muscles are probably come apart. So, doing the plank every day sets you on the right road to recovery. Right, okay. I'm going to do about 30 seconds just because I don't want us to run out of time. And we're going to go again. So, is it okay if we do 30 on each side, Luce? Yeah. We've got time to stretch as well because I don't want the Zoom to run out. We're going to go back to back with our back to back plank. Last plank. Yes, so we'll do left plank 30, right plank, plank 30 straight into just normal plank. Okay, we're ready. Three, two, one. Oh, it's run out. Oh, damn. That's annoying. The room's gone. They'll just finish it, won't they? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to go into the left plank 
for 30 now. This time I'm going to go on my elbows um, to give my wrists a break, like Alice said before. Trying again, it's your body's way of cheating. You want to dip your bum, keep that bum high. Feel right, so that strain. Come back in. Let's see. We've got five seconds. I'll just come straight into the right one. Have a little rest there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and we're going to go to the other side. Thirty seconds. Sorry. Back to back. So I'll tell us when we've done thirty. Okay. We have done ten. Got a booty here blocking the clock. <laughs> There's a booty at the moment, honestly. All this lockdown, boozing, I know. barbecuing. I know. Right, there's 20 seconds. No, 30 actually. Three, two, one. Okay, let's just come over. Plank, oh, nice and low. Fifteen seconds to go, and then we are done for today. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh gosh! Right. So make sure you get some stretching in after the workout. Drink plenty of water and have some good food today. We are absolutely done. We hope you are too. We hope you enjoyed it. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank you guys. See you later.